I always wanted a Louis bag. Like, I just felt like if I get a Louis bag, I would be that girl. I would be accomplished. I would be everything that I need to be. Hey, y'all, sugar in the rain. Welcome, welcome, or welcome back. Today, I'm going to be giving y'all a bag haul. This is a literally... This is literally a last minute video. I was looking in my closet. Actually, I was not looking in my closet. I was in the kitchen and I was thinking, what type of video can I do? And I was like, I might as well do a bag haul because when I have friends come over, they be like, you don't even have a lot of bags, but I do have, mm, I don't want to say pricey bags, but you picking up what I'm putting down? Like, I have a nice selection to choose from. I don't know. I just want to show y'all my bags. And, yeah, I know I look bad right now. Uh, my hair not done, so it's just up in this little fro curl, pineapple, pineapple type thing. We're just going to get right into it. I don't have no lashes on. Oh, so, I'm going to show y'all. I have some designer bags some kind of designer bags and then some like little accessory bags i think i'm gonna show y'all my accessory bags first because they're tiny not really much to like go into and we're gonna do like this first bag is this purple bag i got from shein if you watch my shein haul you probably seen this bag the little button broke from it i don't know where it's at i think that's why i've never worn it worn it wore it it still got the tag on it i might end up selling this bag i don't know but just a little accessory bag the little buckles mad cute but i don't think i'm gonna this bag but i don't know you know when you sell something you're like dang i wish i still had you know so I'm, i might keep this bag i don't know but next is this leather light blue purse um, I got this one and then I got it in black. So cute. It's like a 90s, giving like a 90s vibe. And I never wore these, but my friend had like this 90s party thing that she got coming up and I'm gonna definitely wear one of these bags, so. So cute. Snake skin, get into it. Next is this orange little bag i got this from h&m and by the way i got those two leather bags from shein this bag is from h&m so cute it can fit your phone it can fit a lot of stuff it can, it can fit a lot of stuff it can fit your phone and your lip gloss and your id and that's how you and it has like a gold chain which you can take off so you can wear like a strap or you can wear it like this and it's like a tangerine orange before I go any further, I didn't even give y'all like a backstory. So, growing up, my mom always been like a bad girl. Like, she always had like a nice bag and she would give me her hand-me-downs. And I would just always look at her like, dang, I want to be a bad girl too. Or a purse girl, whatever. So, that's really how I start like, I don't want to say collecting bags, but I feel like I'm starting to collect bags. Like, I'm starting to become a purse addict. Like, I always got to buy a bag. So... That's where I came from. My mom's a, a bad girl, and I'm slowly becoming a bad girl. So, my next bag, I got this from Shein as well. It's just this little. So on Shein website, they advertised it. I can't even do it, but they had it like over them and across. But it's so short. When I do it like that, it come like right here. So I would probably wear it like a little shopping bag. It's just white leather. I never wore this bag, but I'm definitely gonna wear it. I just thought it was really cute, that's why I got it. It's simple, long, cute. It was longer on the website, but it's still cute. It's still giving what it's supposed to give. Next, I just have this little tiny blue bag because I don't have a blue purse and I wanted a blue purse. And I found this at a thrift shop actually for like $3, I think. But it's not cute for like accessories. Like you just take a picture. Oh, it's not gonna fit my arm. So cute, so tiny. You can fit some stuff in here. Just got a little bit of space. 
Long Champ is the brand. I don't think I know what Long Champ is, but yeah. Cute little purse. Next, I have like this, I guess, um, Louis Vuitton inspired. Or oh, I feel like it's Gucci. I'm not sure what brand this is, like inspired, but I feel like it's Louis Vuitton. I don't know, but this is how it looks. Clear with the little silk ribbon or whatever. I never wore it out, but I feel like this is for like, it's giving like, I don't know, because I never was a fan of like people seeing what's in my purse. So I don't think I wear it like to a club or anything, but I'll definitely wear it if it's like a girl's night. I don't know, like a dinner or something. I don't know. I don't like people looking inside my purse, so I don't know why I bought this. I think I just bought this for taking pictures and that's probably it, but super, super cute. My next purse is this sporty looking purse. I love, 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 love. I love this purse. I never wore it, but I really, really, really like this purse. Like, isn't it just so cute? Like, I don't know what it's giving. It's giving, is it Dior? That brand that looks like this shape? I don't know. But this is a really cute bag. I got this one Shein as well. I don't know. I just really, really like this purse. Like, it's different. I like how it looks. I like the color. I like the red. I like everything about this purse. I'm going to wear one of these days, but I haven't worn it yet. So, when I wear it, y'all will see it on my Instagram. I'm going to take a picture because it's like really, really cute. Next, I have this mini snake skin bag. Um, by the way, all the mini bags that I'm showing y'all, well, majority of the bags I'm showing y'all, I've never worn. Like I said, I'm becoming a bag addict. So, I'm just buying purses and I end up never wearing them until like a special occasion only bags i really wear is like my big bags which we'll get into but as far as like my accessory bags i don't i rarely wear them unless i have like like it's like a special occasion i'm like have an outfit plan but i never worn this bag either it has like the little strap if you want to wear it across like a cross body or like let's just take pictures like this <sighs> y'all why am i yeah, this is the bag. Super cute. Oh. And y'all don't look at my nails. Well, I already said it, so y'all probably looking at it. I still got my thumbs on because they won't come off, but I don't have nails on the rest of my nails. But yeah. Super cute. Super cute. My next Shein bag is this little pouch. I wore this probably once or twice. Got receipts in it. Um it's like a little sporty bag. Like it's like a bag that you would wear, well, well, that I wore with like my Vans or like some Converse, Converse or like my um, white Air Force Ones or something like that. Like I won't, this is not a dressy bag. It's just like a little, what's it called? Um, yeah, know little, the little bags that boys wear on their hip or girls wear on their hip, tourists wear on their hip. I don't know what it's called, but y'all know what I'm talking about. That's just what this bag is. You put your little stuff in there, you ready to go. It say, mm, classic collection fashion. And then it says something on top, I don't know what to say. But I got this from Shein as well. Cute, cute, cute. I actually bought this bag because I was going through a streetwear phase and I was just wearing street clothes and I thought this was the perfect bag to go with some of my outfits. My outfits, but then that was like a month phase that went away. So now I don't even dress streetwear, so I don't even. I don't even wear this bag. Ooh, this bag could go with the 90s party that my friend had for me. Or them leather bags. I don't know. My next tiny bag is this green, lime green knot bag. I think this bag is so cute for an accessory. Um, I haven't worn this bag either, but I'm going to. It got this little chain if you want to wear it as a crossbody with the little loops in the inside. This bag is so cute. I love like mini bags. Like I feel like if you're doing like a girls night out you don't want to have a big bag like a mini bag is like my ex accessory i don't know i can't explain it like uh, i always gotta have a bag on like that's just what it is this is the bag cute and i just love how they got this little knot make it a little different than having like a regular handle you know <laughs> my next tiny bag is this little pink bag with the strap 
has a strap to wear as a crossbody too or you can wear it like this this bag is super tiny super cute you can't really fit anything in here you can't fit your phone in here you could barely fit your lip gloss and only about probably your debit cards your id you can't really fit anything this is really a true accessory bag this is for accessories and accessories only this bag is so cute and i got this from shein as well another non-designer bag i have is this black little crossbody bag i actually wore this bag a few times um it's just like a pick me up and go bag if i didn't want to have like a bag on my arm like an arm bag i just use this bag or this purse and go just have like this gold strap it's like a medium not even a medium i would say small but it's not tiny it's like a i'm gonna say medium it's a medium sized little pouch bag crossbody bag and i got this bag from i think i got this bag from h&m y'all be sleeping on h&m h&m got some pretty purses and shoes and accessories and clothes like don't sleep on h&m do not play h&m h&m is not one of them period okay so my next bag is actually a hand-me-down from my mom even though my mom gave me a lot of hand-me-downs i don't have most of those bags now because they wasn't like designer designer so this is really the first designer bag that she hand me down that i was surprised that she let me have it's this Kate Spade cream like a nude color bag it got like the two pockets on the side and then the zipper in the middle you can wear it as a crossbody or you can have it as like a wrist bag when my mom gave me this bag i thought i was the sh do not put them not one of them i thought i was that girl like who you know who you know 17 well, I mean, nowadays you got 16 year olds doing what they do. Back in the day, who you know? Oh, okay, but I love this bag. I wore this bag till I couldn't wear it no more. Like, when I say that, I mean, like, I wore this bag till the creases started to come in. Like, I was wearing this bag, baby. Okay. So, yeah, this is my first, like, designer type thing that my mom had hand-me-down purse from my mom well she keeps saying i stole it i don't know because I, I i i she told me i could have it but now she's saying she want it back and we not doing that it's just this coach little black so bag um i only wear this bag when i work as y'all know your girl is in the military and you can only have like black or new bags so this is really like my mom not my mom bag my um my work purse it's just a simple leather black bag and i just love how simple it is with the little coach symbol a lot of the girls don't like coach but let's get into it i i could i don't rock me a coach purse like just a simple black leather coach bag I feel like everybody need like a simple black leather purse like or tote that's just how i feel so my first ever telfar is the telfar collaboration with of my son's god dad which is my best friend's boyfriend and she's my son's god mom too so they're the, they're a couple which none of this really matters but they're a couple and they're both my son's god parents he actually got me this for christmas it's like a thank you for letting me be your son's god dad type gift and it's actually my first Telfar bag and I love this bag. If you know me, you my friend, you see me on a daily, you know this is my bag. This is my school bag now. Like I keep all my school supplies because y'all know I'm a full-time student. But um some days I will just wear this bag out. Like it's just a simple black bag. I feel like it's a winter bag because this it got the fur and if it be on your skin, it be hot outside, you get the sweat in. Mm -mm. But this is like my favorite, this is my go-to purse like i love this bag and it's the first telly how do you say it tell feezy it's my first tell feezy so it's gonna always play a part have a part have a place near and dear to my heart how do you say it you know what i'm talking about y'all picking up what i'm putting out this is her she will run down now but oh two of my telfar bags i'm actually not gonna show because they're 
gifts to me that I'm not supposed to open right now, but I have another Telfar bag, another small Telfar bag that I'm not gonna open. Um, another one of my Telfar bags is the white one. I felt like I needed an all white bag. Um, so that's the reason why I got it, even though it was just plain and simple. I needed a white bag, so that's why I got the white. Small one, so cute, so tiny, so convenient. When I'm going out with my friends, like to, sorry, to a club, I can always bring my bag inside. You know, if you can, if you have like certain size bags, they don't let you come inside. I always get in with my cell bar bags. They tiny, you can't fit nothing in these bags, but they tiny but cute. Like they give a purpose, it's a statement piece. Like, uh, uh, I think I wore this bag like three or four times. Super, super, super cute. I love my cell bar bags. Like they, they're cute, but they're like simple. You know, like they got that logo. But other than that logo, they like mad simple. But I'm gonna keep buying them, and I'm gonna keep buying them, and I'm gonna just keep doing it because that's just what I do. And my last tail far bag is the copper i think that's the color it's like a i'm pretty sure it's the copper one it look rose gold mm. i don't know it look gold on camera and in person it look gold but i'm pretty sure it's the copper one what kind of rose gold i don't know I love this. Bag. No, that black Telfar is not my first Telfar. This is my first Telfar. How could I forget? This is my first Telfar bag. I lied. That black one was not my first Telfar. This was my first one. This is my very first one, Telfar bag. And I think I only wore this bag like twice. But when it was in stock, I had to get it. It was so cute. And ugh, honestly, y'all, I just want to see if I can get it. Like it's always sold out within minutes. So when they restocked it, I was like, let me just see if I can get it in. And I got it. So that, yeah, that was this is my first tail bar. Okay, so my MCM, what's it called? Hand bag. So let me tell y'all about this bag. So I have a friend who bought the big bag. And you know, the big bag comes with the handbag. But she didn't want the handbag. And I didn't want the big bag. I just don't like I don't really like this color, so I didn't. I wasn't too crazy about getting the big bag, so, but I really wanted the small bag. So she gave me her small bag. This, I said that black Telfar bag is my go-to. I think this is my first go-to. Like I love this little purse. Like it's small, but it's a statement piece, and it can fit everything I need for it to fit my phone. My like it, like it's not a purse. I think it's like a um. Not a wallet, but they call it something on the website. It's not really considered a purse. I love this bag. Like, oh my goodness. I'm looking now that you can take this off. But you can't take it off this. So I'm assuming you could clip it inside your big bag and have it as like a little wallet inside the big bag. But I wear it as a purse because it's so cute. Like, I love... Love, 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 love this handbag. It's just simple, cute, small, and it's a piece. It's a statement piece. Like, I love my MCM. I think I'm gonna show my Marc Jacobs and then my Louis Vuitton because my Louis Vuitton is an accomplishment. Like, I, I'm not even, I'll get into that when I get into that. But I recently just got this bag. Um, I think it was like four or 300 i can't remember it's the rose dust color it's so freaking cute yeah get into it y'all know my favorite color is pink and black but pink and it's like a not too bright but not too dull pink like it's like that dusty pink i mean it's rose dust and it's so freaking pretty like i love this bag Love, love, love. Like, I you ever love something so much you like scared to wear it? I'm scared to wear it. I wore it once for my birthday dinner, wore it once, got back home, put it back in the dust bag. Like, I love this bag 
so cute. And I always wanted a Marc Jacob bag and I finally found one that was in stock and luckily it was my favorite color pink. So I had to get it, super cute. I really, really love that. And I got so many compliments when I wore it on my birthday dinner. Like the girls was loving the bag and I to, I love this bag. Like love it, love it, love it, love it, gotta have it. Okay, last but not least is the big Louis V. E. Louis Vuitton Don't Play With Her. Never Full Bag. I think that's what it's called. I always wanted a Louis bag. Like, I just felt like if I get a Louis bag, I would be that girl. I would be accomplished. I would be everything that I need to be. So, I've been saving my money because I've been knowing that I've always wanted a Louis V bag. And it's not really much to it. Yeah, I just saved my money and I finally have the guts to spend my money on a Louis V bag. Um, I don't want to say the price, but I don't know. I always keep the receipt I'm sure, in the bag because I just, not that I care if people think it's fake. I don't know. I just always keep the receipt in the bag. You never know. You never know. You never know. So this is her super huge with the red interior and I actually bought um it's so big like my son literally can fit inside this bag this bag is so big at the point I was getting irritated and I was about to sell the bag because it's just so freaking big but then I was like I'll be dumb because you wanted a little bit your whole life and now that you finally got one you that one makes sense selling it so just keep it that but I bought one of these off Amazon to like keep it intact keep like my stuff because this bag be eating up all my stuff it be swallowing my stuff i be looking for stuff i can't find it so i had to buy that to like organize my bag and then with the bag it came with this little pouch and y'all this is like one of my biggest accomplishments like i love 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 i love this purse and then with this purse it ooh, hit me in the face it has like these little clips right here and you can like clip the you see that? top if you want to and yeah it's just a big it's just a big bag like i don't know it's a really really big bag like i just felt so accomplished walking out that store with this big bag like i walked out the store to i was like yeah big yeah big e not the little one but yeah you guys that pretty much sums up my bag haul i hope you guys liked all my bags as much as i love them i'm gonna be selling most of those accessory bags like i was saying i don't really use them so they're taking up space in my closet if y'all see any bags that y'all liked um in the video after that black um after this bag so any bag that i posted before this bag if anybody see any bag that they like i would definitely be more than happy to get it out to you just reach out if that's something that you're interested in this is me and my element becoming a bad girl like hopefully over time we build 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 like hopefully if i do a part two in the future the bags will be all this will be stacked with bags all this area right here will be bags piled on top of bags but that's all i have right now so yeah. but make sure you guys like comment subscribe 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 and i'm gonna see y'all in my next video bye <music>